People living along Peacock Lane are getting ready to light up the neighborhood this weekend with their annual holiday light displays. Cor Harlan is live to tell us more about this Southeast Portland tradition. Cor? It's a tradition going back to the 1920s, Jenny, and uh, we've got one of the people who's a new resident on Peacock Lane this year. Tanya's her first name here, and they've got the front of the house all lit up uh, in llama theme here. How'd you it come is. up with llamas for a idea well we wanted to do something a little bit different and uh, maybe non-traditional I was uh, inspired by the uh, mountain peaks therapy llamas here in Portland and I met them last year in our first uh, visit to Portland There's a little ode to uh, Rojo the llama over there Carl show that up there and you've got llamas climbing up the gables there you got everything decked out in Christmas lights Tanya this looks like a beautiful house right here and the lights uh, up on the tree, all adorned out in the tree there. It's a fabulous looking house. Thanks for lighting it up for us this morning. It looks nice. It looks great. Keep it on for another hour. And uh, this is one of like four blocks worth of homes on Peacock Lane. They will open on Sunday, okay? Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday will be pedestrian only nights uh, here along Peacock Lane. And it uh, will be a really good good deal here. Here's another house across the street here. This is Ted Brockwood here. He's been on the street for 16 years. 20 seconds real quick, Ted. Uh, just give me the give me the flavor for, for what the spirit is on the street here. Oh, uh, you know, it's the Portland DIY spirit. Instead of, you know, the blowout million light bulbs kind of thing, it's everybody does their own thing and we just welcome the public to be here. It's completely free. Uh, they shouldn't expect to pay for anything when they come to visit the lane. It's all a good time here. From Peacock Lane this morning, this will be about 40th and Southeast Belmont. Again, Jenny, this starts on Sunday, Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday, pedestrian only nights, no cars on the lane for a great, great view of some Christmas lights. Yeah, that, it takes such skill to do that every year, and uh, I appreciate those people's dedication. Yeah. <laughs> <For> sure. <laughs> Thank you, Corey. Yeah, we were just talking about our lights. I said it looks like.